thousands of students in North Carolina are headed back to school this morning for the first time since Hurricane Floyd hit. Schools are open in Edgecombe County, where they have been closed since September 15th. Floyd's floodwaters damaged many of the state's schools and completely destroyed two of them. Volunteers worked through the weekend to get the classrooms ready for today's reopening. For just the sixth time in baseball history, a one-game playoff will determine a postseason berth. Yesterday, the New York Mets beat the Pittsburgh Pirates 2-1 to one after Pittsburgh reliever Brad Klontz threw a wild pitch with the bases loaded. That let the Mets' Melvin Mora score. The Cincinnati Reds then beat the Milwaukee Brewers 7-1. to one. This all forces a one-game playoff between the Reds and the Mets. The teams will play tonight at Synergy Field in Cincinnati. The opening bell has just sounded on Wall Street. For the latest on the market, here's CNBC's Liz Clayman with your Money Minute. Hi, Liz. Good morning, Patty Emmett. Back to you. All right. Thanks so much, Liz. And you can follow all the markets, find up-to-the-minute stock quotes, and get much more financial news in the business section of MSNBC.com. Today, you can find out how a small Kentucky town is turning itself into a high-tech capital.